Yeah, the engagement with Axiom was really about an organizational redesign to uh, not necessarily go in and, and take resources away. In fact, what we did um, was we just made more efficient use of the resources we had. So it wasn't a situation where we had a lot of competitors at the time who were letting people go, business was rough, uh, in an attempt and effort to, uh, you know, to make their financials or meet their needs. That, that wasn't really the goal, and what they helped us do was really take the existing headcount that we had or the money that we had associated with that in terms of SGNA, and then really apply that to the areas of the business that we needed uh, to put more emphasis against to be successful. As I look back on what's occurred since 2009, we've had phenomenal results, and I think there's a number of reasons we have had phenomenal results. We've streamlined the way we plan and, and we go about business, but one of the areas I think that I would really attribute to the work that we did with Axiom was how we changed the face of our organization from a sales perspective. Um, we were very focused on distributor management and pressed a lot of resources against them, and in the past that served us well. Uh, as we got moving forward, we found out we were lighter in other areas of the business, like national accounts and key accounts. Um, and Axiom did a terrific job at just helping us really very simply distill and, and talk about three or four things that were important to us and how we wanted to get there, and then helped us design a structure that would help us meet those goals. And I think as a result, if you look at it and you look at the results we've had since this restructure, I mean, they've been absolutely phenomenal and we're far outpacing the industry. Um, and, uh, you know, are in a very good place as a result.